Hi guys, welcome back to Golden Sun. Last time we played, uh, we talked to Kraden, this nice old guy, he came with us, and we saw some familiar faces from three years ago. And they didn't kill us this time, or try to kill us, or whatever. You get the idea. So now, we are, uh, we snuck past some monks, or bishops, or whatever you want to call them. Friar? I, I, I don't know the proper term. To this, the Soul Sanctum. Let's go. This is the entrance to Soul Sanctum. This is your first time here, right? Yes. It's an important relic of our past. Take a good look at it. All right, so this is the real first place that you get to go. Um, and it's the first place that introduces puzzles and stuff. So, like, here's a jumping puzzle. You can jump across things that are one space. So, you can end up... Like, if I go this way, I will end up progressing. Though, over here, I wouldn't be able to progress, because I can't jump too. So, we're going to the next door. So, um, this is a place where there's a lot of walking. There should be a lot of... Uh, yeah, here we go, some encounters. So, now I get to show off sy uh, Synergy. Uh, so I've got a nice party of three here. Uh, you don't have anything useful yet, so you'll just attack, but you've got strong attacks. You you have flame, but I don't care. You'll, you'll, you'll attack. You've got magic, so you lose flare. Or synergy, not magic. Whatever. Alright, let's set some things on fire. Now, that looks familiar, don't it? It looks like a weaker version of that thing that Minardi used on Garrett, uh, Garrett and Isaac, right? And that's because it is. In fact, we get to use what they used later. We don't get to use everything that they use, but... It's cool stuff, though. Nice blue. Uh... Long hallways, too. At least there's plenty of battles. Kill this mushroom. Oh, one, one thing that bugs me about the combat, actually, is... And it was fixed in the second game. It was fixed in the second game. Another jumping puzzle. Was that you couldn't, um... If you attacked a person, and someone else was going to attack that person... Oh, what's this? It's a relief of a minotaur. Its right eye is sparkling, but there's a hole where its left should be. Okay, so we need to come back there. Well, um, like, say I have everyone... I'll, I'll demonstrate here, actually. I'll have everyone attack this bat. So Jenna attacks, dodges. Okay. Bat takes 11. It lives, so we... Okay. Maybe next turn I'll be able to show it off. Okay. So we all attack Bat 2. Jenna attacks, hits it, I attack, Isaac attacks, 12 damage, it dies. Now Garrett doesn't have anything to attack. So he's defending. And this would be cool if it set it from the beginning. But it doesn't. What it ends up doing is, since it doesn't know that uh, that mushroom would die until now, Garrett only starts defending after he uh, after that point, so he doesn't get the increased defensive abilities until he's defending, so now he's defending. But we don't care about that, we'll just kill this wild mushroom. Alright, Bat's party goes down, we got three experience points and four points. Sweet! Alright, I'm going to use some Psy Energy now, so I'm uh, gonna show off the UI a bit. I'm gonna cure, gonna use a cure, gonna use a cure. Alright, so now we all have full health. Now note my Psy Energy on Isaac is 9 of 18. Uh, Isaac doesn't have a ton of uh, Psy Energy points, but it's no biggie, you know? Uh, you regain Psy Energy points uh, by walking around in uh, places where you can be attacked, so. So there's that. Now here, oh, a dead end. There's a lot of dead ends in this game. Kind of frustrating, but... Doo -doo -doo -doo. More hopping. Now, I don't think you can be... Hmm. I don't think you can be attacked on these, which is kind of nice. Because it lets you think, and then, you know, think on the run. But we'll head up here and get attacked again. Kill these bats. Kill these bats. Make that go a little quicker. Alright. So let's get going. 
Now we have this chest here. A chest. And it's a small jewel. Alright, let's see what the small small jewel says. Item. A beautifully shaped a beautifully eye-shaped jewel. Or a beautiful eye-shaped jewel. I can't read today. Okay, so well that tells us exactly what we need to know about it. In that it's probably the key to whatever this thing is. Or this mechanism over here. Pretty simple puzzle, right? It's a relief of a minotaur. The right eye is sparkling, but there's a hole where the left should be. So, when you're talking to something, or interacting with something, and then it brings up the menu, that's its way of saying, okay, now you need to do something particular. So, pull out your, or you go to your item, and you go to small jewel, and now you have a use, so you can use it. And now Isaac sets the small gem into the empty socket, and we can progress. You hear the sound of shifting stone. Now I'll sp speed up this, uh, this a bit, just for... Oop. Oh, I'm running at 50% speed, that's unusual. Okay, there we go, we're back to full speed. We'll just flip two bats, kill the bats. Have you some synergy? There you go. We're good. And all right. Now we're in the inner, uh, the inner part of the sanctum. Oh, it looks like a dead end. What's wrong, Graydon? Those two said there was a hidden passage leading deeper into the sanctum. I've come here many times, and I've always thought it looked strange. I've always imagined Soul Sanctum would look different somehow. What do you mean? Soul Sanctum was built in honor of the sun. There ought to be something here to reflect that. I was always puzzled why there wasn't. That's, that's actually pretty, a pre pretty reasonable thought. I mean, Soul does come... Uh, Soul is the... Or is a... Latin word? I don't, I don't, I don't know if it's Latin. I don't know if it's Latin. Don't quote me on that. Do not quote me on that. Anyway, but it does mean... It does mean... Or refer to the sun. And since this is the Soul Sanctum, you'd imagine that there'd be sun stuff. If there is a hidden passage, then maybe it leads to... Well... Let's see if we can find it. All right, let's do this. Right. I think he's serious. Should we help him, Isaac? Well, duh. That's all, only why we came. But it's too dangerous for us to split up. We should stay together. Ha ha! Yes, we're not going to Scooby Doo this. All right, let's do it. So, nice statues. Now you see over here, we get this dotted pattern, and that shows us we can move this. Pretty cool. But there's this thing here, and we can't do anything with this. So guess what? It's another dead end. There's a lot of dead ends. Hi, okay. Let's go let's go kill this bat and this slide. Nice job, Jenna. Okay. That, that that slime was very clearly, clearly terrified of being hit in the face with a stick. Okay, we'll just kill this bat. Shouldn't be too hard. Yeah. One experience point. You only you don't only get experience for things that you kill. There are ways to get more experience for something, but we'll, but we'll get to that when we get to that. All right. Now here's a staircase. This is clearly where we're supposed to go. Let's see, is this a dead end? Oh, okay. That way is probably just a path that goes on. Alright, let's uh, attack the slime. Use some flare, use some flare. Alright. And they're all dead! Oh, oh, now they're all dead. Good thing I attacked the slime. Otherwise, Isaac would have just done nothing. Hey! Alright, mastered the quake. Time to set the Let's see if there's anything up this way. Alright, so there's a chest over here. Some slimes over here, but we'll, we'll show off some quake, and flare, and flare. Sounds good. Oh, 
now I'm faster than Joe. All right, so that's 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 cool. I like that it brings the uh, it kind of brings the stage with it almost. All right, we should we should heal heal Jenna though. There's some cure. There we go. Don't want her dying on me. The chest and oh look another small jewel. That tells me since I remember the first jewel, there's probably another relief around here somewhere. So we'll kill these guys pretty quickly. Like it, it brings it brings the floor with it, which is really cool. There's a gen, uh, sorry, a gen in the next game. And if you don't know what a gen is, gen is yet, don't worry about it. But you'll definitely oh, it's level two guard. Nice. But you'll definitely like them when we come across them. They're very useful. Very useful. Well, anyway, so um, one of them, it's called like a quad or something, and when you use it, it picks up the map, or the, the background, and turns it into a ball and throws the ball at the enemy. It's totally cool. One of my favorite visual effects in uh, a Golden Sun game. Oh yeah, see? See, uh, Garrett's defending, and the slide runs away like a little puck. Jenna is now a level 2 flame user. All right. Let's see. Okay. Looks like a long way around. Slime one appeared. Oh, we got caught by a surprise. It chooses to run. Oh my goodness. What a pussy. What a pussy. Okay. These guys are dead. And we'll keep going. Okay. So this we can progress without having to deal with it. Now, we can't get to any of those, but they look like they can be moved. Or statues, hmm? It doesn't look like we can reach them from here. Perhaps synergy is the key. Yeah, you know, that's that's probably a good thought, considering that we're in a temple, or a sanctum, in fact, dedicated to synergy. It's like the origin of your people's synergy or synergy I don't uh, I don't think that's surprising at all perhaps synergy is the key Isaac try to use your synergy okay so here we could either do something like going into the menu then use selecting synergy then using move and then we get to press left or right or whatever direction to move it oh nice first try MMLG okay so I will put the uh, put the small jewel in its place. Something clicks, or a little more than clicks. Shifting stone. Okay. Now we gotta find the other one. I'm gonna guess here. Here looks good. Actually, can I? Yeah. Okay. Yes, sir. So instead of going through the menu, we can set a shortcut like what I did before. So you go into synergy. And you go to a person, and you select, sect, uh, I'm gonna set, move to R again. So I press R, and then you select a synergy. So you select the synergy, and then you get to use it, just by pressing R. There's nothing there. Okay, I was wrong. Is it here? Is it here? There it is! I should've, I should've known. I should've known. And we're into another corridor. corridor. Amazing grace, how sweet the ghost that gets killed by some kids. It hurt my guy, but now he died, and we got experience. All right, let's heal up. Ow, there we go. All right, let's do this. Ah, here we go. This, this looks cool. Music changed. This is it! We found it! Clearly, this is the mark of the sun. The heart of Soul Sanctum. It's just as I'd imagined, which means those two are telling the truth. Didn't they also mention a trap three years ago? We should probably be on our guard. 
But if what they said was true, then that means they must have been... They were thieves! They came to rob the Sanctum! Let's hurry back to the village and tell everybody! Graydon? Graydon, what's the matter? No. We're so close. Close? Close to what? We've come all the way to the heart of the Soul Sanctum. To turn our backs now? And to leave? There's something wrong with that? Soul Sanctum holds the origins of alchemy. It would be such a waste to... What do you think? Shall we go a little farther? Yes, yes, actually. I am a man of science, my good elderly, gen elderly gentleman. Let's go on further. Thank you! <laughs> if you put it that way, we don't have much choice. No, no, we don't. I'm with Graydon. I want to look inside. Weren't you just saying that you wanted to leave? Really? <clears throat> really? <clears throat> Really? We'll just go a little bit further. Back to the old man grid and the Batman grid. Good, it's decided. Let's move ahead. Alright. Again, if you have any ideas on terms of voices and stuff, be sure to be sure to tell me in the comments or whatever. However you want to reach me. I don't make it too difficult. Anyway. Ooh. Ooh. What? What is this room? Nice aurora you got there. There is a moon in the center. A picture of Luna. Oh, right. Old man voice. This might... This must symbolize night. These rooms must be connected somehow, don't you think? Well, duh. Of course they are. You can Luna and Sol. These rooms must hide some secret. What could it be? Hmm... What does it all mean? Isaac, would you look farther up the passage? Of course! Let me know what you find. Oh, you're just gonna stay here, huh? Huh? Leave all the scientific discovery to the youths of the world, huh? Anyway, these, these statues look pretty nice. 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 Okay. Well, let's go down this way. And there's doors. Now, always go the other way first. Nice. Alright, sweet. So, we don't really need it. So, I'll ignore it. But that's a Synergy Stone. You can touch it, and then it'll regenerate all of your Synergy Points. Alright. So what do we got here? Okay, okay. We've got these statue things. Let's... Move it! Okay. So it's switching the thing. Nice! What? What's happening?! Isaac must have found something. Oh, oh, uh oh, that's no good. Isaac, stop! You're about to make a big mistake. Yeah, hurry on, old man. Wait, Isaac! What's wrong, Creighton? That looks like a thing. This is a most interesting mechanism you found, Isaac. But this is clearly some kind of trap. This is a trap? Go look in the lunar room and you'll understand. Okay. Done well! Finding this means you're looking in the right place! Yeah, that that is a good point. That is a good point, because unless you're super tricky, you're not gonna put a trap somewhere that you uh you know, you're not you're not gonna put a trap somewhere that isn't protecting something. And in fact, in in any way really, I mean even even if it's a decoy trap, you're, you're still putting it there to protect something. So the fact that we're finding traps means there's something pretty important. But if you move just one statue, you'll be caught in the Sanctum's trap. But why would anyone put a trap here anyway? 
I don't know who did it, but they've hidden something very important. Perhaps they've hidden the key to alchemy itself, or synergy, or, you know, whatever. Should I tell you more? Yes. Exposition! Hmm, honestly, I doubt if you could understand it if I explained it. Then why did you offer, old man? We must try to find the solution to this mystery. Sheesh, another mystery? My janky scoob. All these mysteries, man. I'll... <clears throat> okay, okay. Enough shaggy. I'll keep checking the Luna Room. You continue exploring the Sanctum. Ooh, nice clouds outside, by the way. My intuition tells me that this light must be the key to the secret. Or that light must be the key to the secret. We should test it. Alright. Isaac, let's see if we can't figure this out ourselves. Alright. Well, if two grave robber people or grave robber thieves or whoever, treasure hunters maybe, couldn't figure out the puzzle. What makes you think that three kids could figure it out? I mean, Creighton maybe, but three kids? Alright, I already know the solution to this puzzle. I'll bet you've probably figured out the solution to this puzzle. I mean, it's... Oops, oops, oops. Bring this here. Only because I like doing it this way. So we'll push this into place. And now we're shining light on the ground there, right? Light is the key, right? Light is right because light is the light. So we'll get this in place and then. Oop, there we go. A hole appears! That's some mechanism. Something clicked! There we go, that's something that clicks. Alright. So now let's move this, this this statue. We'll turn that into the sun. Let's see what happens. Does this stuff explode yet? What? What's happening? The thing's flickering and... 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 Boom. Isaac must have found something. You found it, Isaac! Craden! Craden! There we go. Oh, hey, look, that's part of the moon now. Makes sense. Excellent work, Isaac! Where did that hole come from? When Isaac moved those. When Isaac moved those statues, two beams of light shot out from them. Yeah, every time, here it's voice something different in it. And then this hole appeared in the floor. And and Isaac dropped the statue into it after that. Hmm. Good work, everyone. Hmm. So, the statue puzzle was the trap. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. I guess so. I mean, we still needed to do it. And the other statue was here to disarm the trap. Yeah, yeah, that's a good way of putting it, actually, Kraden. It was a very good way of putting it. And now that you've disarmed it, we should be all right. It should be. Nothing could possibly go wrong here, right? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. I'll observe from the Lunar Room where it's safe. You handle the rest. Where it's safe. Yes, Kraden. Yes, Kraden. Thank you. Thank you for leaving the dangerous job that you just said was dangerous to children. What a jerk. Alright. Oh, we'll shine the light on this, and it'll switch over. One last piece. And there we go. Alright, now let's get going. Or actually, let's go take a peek over here. And see, now it's entirely the moon. And that's the sun. And... Now yep. yeah, we've got full synergy, so... Or synergy, so I won't bother with the synergy stone. Alright. Hey, Graydon. Look, Isaac! The picture of Luna changed to soul! 
but other than that, nothing looks different. That's strange. They went to the trouble of putting a trap here, and this is all that happens? Somewhere, something else must have changed. We must find it. Alright. So, Graydon was just paying attention to this room. Now, if the one upstairs changed, and the one to the next, uh, to the next side of it, or to the side of it, rather, changed as well, what do you think happened in the original, or in the, uh, soul room back there? If you answered it turned into the moon and is now shooting a laser at the wall, you're right. So, why is it shooting a laser at the wall? Look, it changed to Luna. Surely there must be something in this room. Maybe it's where that... Hmm, light is the key. Maybe we should follow the light. A portal thing. Now you're thinking with portals. Aha! This has to be it! Oops, I took a screen cap. Let's go, Isaac. Wait, so three people just went at, went in at once through a portal. Isn't there like a... Uh, that sounds like the introduction to a terrible sci-fi movie where they all get mushed together and turn into some sort of... Uh, some sort of single entity. Can't be good. Can't be good. Anyway, Kraden comes in too. Cool sounds too. Hey guys, this is Abon. Uh, I'm gonna cut the video here, and then we'll continue on in the next part. Just because I don't want this to be a an hour long portion. So I'll see you next time, which won't be that long from now. Bye bye.